this room. We have like the loudest. Bit. Hey, what is up guys? I am Scary Husky here today and today we are back with our second Fur squared, fursuit interview. It's sad because this will probably come out in July. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we are back with our second fur squared, fursuit interview. Guys, we are back today with Paprika and you just got your suit. Yeah, I got her, I got her yesterday. Today's, what's today? The 22nd? I don't know. 22nd, I got her on the 21st. She was shipped out the 20th. So, it was pretty expensive. My yeah. days mesh together. I don't know what Yeah. Do. I thought it was Thursday and then I found out it was Friday. So I literally just unboxed her. Here she is. Fucking She's adorable. here. Yeah, I know. Thank you. Wait, how good is the vision? How good is the vision? Uh, the vision. You're, you're new to suiting. Uh, I let you wear my I'm not. I'm not new to suiting. Oh, you're not new to suiting? No, I'm not new to but suiting. But this is your, like, like, this is your suit. This is the first one that's yours. No. No? No. Really? Yeah. Wow. I had two other suits. What the fuck? Yeah. I've only had one! <laughs> what the hell? This that's one, the one that's what I have on right now. Yeah, this one I can see the best out of. So so you wore you wore mine earlier. I let you wear mine for a minute. Yes. Whose vision is better? Uh Ascari's is better. <laughs> like I, I have like I just can't see anything below there. Uh, uh I I can't see right here and right here <laughs> and right there. I can't see shit, <laughs> but that's alright. Cause my first suit was way worse because it was on buckram and his eyes are yellow and it was really tight buckram so i was stumbling everywhere so guys the first suit interview series is a series where i go to twitter i will post a photo of said suitor nine out of ten times and get questions from the audience however i was very 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 slow to posting these interviews for Fur Squared. So a lot of these questions are gonna be questions that are come up by me. But like I said, this is a brand new suit, like legit, just like you just got this suit. So guys, go check out their Twitter, go check out this awesome suit. Uh, but that being said, are you ready? I am ready. So how, do you know how this works? I'm pretty sure. You're pretty sure? We're like 70% <laughs> I'm, sure. I'm like almost 100% because I've watched it since the first one. So. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. Man, so you've seen like 50 different videos. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, let's get into some of these questions. So the first question we have is by uh, Sybil, and that is, how was working with Oakley as your suit maker? She's definitely a dream maker of mine. So how was it working with that suit maker? Um, she's a sweetheart. She has like the best customer service, like from like art commissions or pursuit commissions. She responds like immediately and she's just very sweet and she'll go out of her way to make sure you're happy with the product. The only thing that <laughs> could be fixed is that she forgets a lot of stuff sometimes. So you got to remind her <laughs> cause uh, I wanted like, I wanted some extra details on her stuff and then She's like, oh yeah, you already paid for that. And I was just like, oh, I paid for the other thing. That's, you know, that's all right. <laughs> but she's overall very sweet. She does a very good job. She does, she made my character come to life and she's perfect. She looks exactly how she does on the rest. And I couldn't be happier. I totally recommend her as a person maker. <laughs> so the next one we have is by, uh, that blue shadow, yeah, blue shadow moon, and that is, why are you the mean king queen? I don't understand. Um, I'm I, really, I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> I guess I'm the meme king queen because I'm just a living, breathing meme, I guess. I don't know, I don't know, I don't even know who that is, so I don't understand why they just assume that I was the meme king queen. I'm very confused. I cannot believe. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. I was, say, I, I was like hoping for like a dramatic background. Like I took a photo and my face just looked so mean. No, I don't. I don't know. I take bad pictures of myself, but none uh, that's okay. Me too. Not to be me worthy. I don't even know them. So the next question we have is by oh, fuck, there we go. Is by uh, at I can't read those these fucking names. 
pick names that are easy to pronounce, like John or Zach or some <laughs> shit. And I guarantee you, you'll like look at it and be like, oh, it's this. Oh, it's Mari. That's her. Oh. How do I say your name? Uh, Mari. Mari Kimchi. It shows A or no, I'm talking about the person above that. Not oh, Mari. Aiden? I can't see shit. <laughs> Everything like when the phone It looks like just, Aiden, yeah. but just like their parents wanted their kid to be special. So the question is by that person then, and that is uh, ask them how. I like how they like phrased it for me to ask. Yeah. Them. Ask them how the experience with their suit is going, and if they would want to change anything about it now that they have it. You've had it for a day. Yeah, I've had it for a day, but like already. I mean, it's pretty all right for a first day. The only thing that's a problem, and it's not even really that big of a problem, is that she's really tight. And I have like a headache at like all times. <laughs> that is it a foam? What? Is it a foam base? It is a foam okay. base. So when I first got my head, my head was a little bit tight. But yeah. as I, the more and more I took it on and off, the more and more I wore it, the less and less it became. Yeah. So over time, it'll it'll get better. Yeah, I figured because my older suits they they were bigger. Cause I don't know, they didn't really take my head measurements. They took theirs. I guess I have pretty big head because it fits on and off pretty all right. But yeah, I'm ho I'm hoping that's the case because I have the fattest headache right now. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say because like I said, the first time I wore mine, it was really really tight. Yeah. But now it's fine. That's good. So yeah, if it's made of foam, it'll stretch out and basically oh, conform to your head. I could not imagine if she was made out of resin or something. I'd be hurting. <laughs> I'd be hurting real bad. So the next question is by okay. That's, that's Mari. By, yeah. Uh, is by Mari, and that is, uh, what's the best way possible to save up money for a professional suit maker? Um. So, <laughs> so I kind of got lucky because uh, my gra <laughs> my grandma is rich. I'm, t <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. She gave me money for like, we had two funerals, so she just had the, she felt the need to give me money, so, but that's how I got her, well not really, cause I sell fursuit and art and stuff, keep going at that, but I got a job at Culver's and Walmart, and it was agony, I don't recommend it, but if you're not really that talented or you can't find anybody else to get your art, then you're probably gonna have to. It wasn't bad. I made $11 an hour. That's not too bad, I guess. I, I quit right after I finished paying off Paprika. <laughs> it was, <laughs> that's how it is. So if you, got, if you got rich parents, or if you get a pretty all right job, then you're set. I don't know, for me it was just creating a budget. I already had, I already had a budget and I had the savings and whatnot, so. I just, I'm just not good with money, so I don't, you should not ask me that question ever again. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think about the furry community? Yeah, it was exactly, a, I don't know why my brain was saying why, no, what do you think about the furry community? I like the furry community, <clears throat> but sometimes it could just be a little, like, literally why are you doing this at all time like i'm never on twitter because of it because everyone's just like at each other i'm just like come on i just want to be a cute dog like that's all i want but on the other hand like i've been to a bunch of like anime cons and stuff and furries are a lot more nicer than cosplayers and stuff because cosplayers and furries usually do not get along that well <laughs> they think they're better than us but we are just the same. We're both equally as terrible. <laughs> and then the last question they had was thoughts on mer suits. <laughs> thoughts on mer suits. Um, I don't really care <laughs> about mer suiters. Like, do you? As long as you clean your suit, and that's that's it. As long as like you're not gross and you don't smell. If you don't smell and you clean off your suit, you're fine. You're cool. I like you. I don't care if you're a mirror suit or not, like, just be clean. <laughs> That's it, really. And the last question we have is by uh, at Ratboy, and that is, uh, hi, I'm interested in how you describe your game system. I don't know how you already answered that. Huh, I kind of already answered that one. Oh. 
Oh no. <laughs> Exactly. So Asher asks, uh, if you could change the species of your character, what would it be? Um, I would pick a Sotaru, because I'm Mountain Dew themed, or a cat. Hmm. I would probably be... If I could somehow execute it, I'd be a crab. Because crabs are my favorite animals. Like, aside from corgis, they're my favorite animals. But, like, I don't know how that would work. Cause like, I don't know why, but I just like, had to be a canine. I had to be a corgi. Cause corgis, corgis are my favorite animals and then there, and there's like crabs and stuff. But I do have an eel fursona. So I could, I'd either go with like an eel or crab. I like sea creatures. I think they're very cool. So guys, I appreciate you watching this interview. This is like probably 30 or 40 some on the channel. We have done a fucking ton of these. If you guys enjoyed this, be sure to drop a like. If this is the first time you've heard of this suitor, be sure to go check out their social media. That'll be all linked below. And uh, <laughs> is there anything left that you want to tell people? I'm on every single social media at Corgi High. Please give me attention. That TikTok game though. Dude, I'm on TikTok. Yeah, I, I'm on TikTok. I, 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 I'm on that. <laughs> I follow you on TikTok. Yeah, it happens. Yeah. It's TikTok. It's a guilty pleasure. <laughs> I get home from work and just like, well, what are we doing today? TikTok time. <laughs> so guys, like I said, if you enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like. Check out their social media. So guys, I'm Ascari Husky. I'm Paprika. And I will see everyone in the next video.